So do you guys need extra gear slots within your player's inventory because you're just picking up gear left, right and centre and it's just always full? Or you want to farm more before you sell them? Well today guys I have you covered and I will explain exactly how you get and maximise your carry potential within Hogwarts Legacy. Okay, so in which slots and how to expand upon these is one of the questions I am constantly being asked within Hogwarts Legacy. The game is out now worldwide, so I thought I'd make a quick guide on how you actually do this, because it's quite simple. Okay, so you start with a max of, I believe, 20 gear slots, but you can expand upon this quite easily. Okay, so as you play the game, guys, you'll eventually come to a mission called the trials of merlin now this is a straightforward mission to do to be honest i mean you can't really miss it like i said i believe it's literally one of the main quest lines so you have to do this guys and well you'll get this done i'm not going to spoil it for you it's a basically a little puzzle that you have to do after helping an old lady take out a few enemies but upon you completing this trial guys from this moment forward upon your main map you will see a ton of these uh, Merlin trials absolutely everywhere. Uh, requirements, it says the trials of Merlin and uh, Mallow Sweet Leaves. These are the requirements for these. But once you get these done, people, they actually go towards challenges, which we'll see right here, exploration. And if we come down, we can see here the trials of Merlin. Complete these guys and it increases your storage for gear. Therefore, expanding upon your inventory now the more of these you do the more you will unlock now i actually haven't started doing these yet just been progressing other things but yes the more of these guys you do the more you will expand upon that gear it really is that simple guys again these are like mini base puzzles pretty fun to uh, solve and do and you're rewarded for them with increasing your storage for that gear now to make it a lot easier on yourself because like i said the requirement for these merlin trials are the mallow sweep leaves and while well, you're going to need these for every trial if you want to expand upon that inventory space so to get these it's quite simple and the best way of doing it in my opinion is 100 percent growing your own so if you have 200 spare galleon 200 spare gold come to hogsmeade and you want to come to this shop right here this vendor now this vendor come here and she will sell you the seeds for 200 gallon like i said so yeah it really is that simple guys then take this to the room of requirement and then grow these things it's it's probably the best way of doing this because like i said if you want to do these merlin trials you want to maximize your gear inventory space these are a requirement to do these so yes keep that in mind I think you'll also be able to buy these leaves from this vendor the first time you come here but i think she'll sell out pretty quickly so it is definitely best to buy the seed and grow them yourself and there we have it guys a lowdown on merlin trials how you take part in them and how you expand upon your gear inventory space guys if you enjoyed the video leaving a like really helps out if you like what you see and want to see more hogwarts legacy be sure to subscribe and hopefully guys i will see you on that next one